Picture this, Mars, once a vibrant world with vast oceans, winding rivers, and rain-filled skies, is now a small, cold, and dry desert with a thin atmosphere. This dramatic transformation leaves scientists scratching their heads about both its intriguing past and current state. The tiny size and rapid cooling of Mars caused it to lose its magnetic field, atmosphere, and ultimately its water turning it into a barren wasteland. By delving into the history of Mars, we gain eye-opening insights into the delicate balance needed for a planet to sustain life, underscoring the stark difference between Earth and its smaller red neighbor. In this fascinating video, we'll explore the reasons and science behind how Mars met its fate. Mars, often dubbed the Red Planet, might seem like a dull, lifeless place, but it's anything but boring. Its thin atmosphere makes it incredibly cold and dry, yet it's full of surprises. One of the most striking features of Mars is its massive dust storms, so large they can envelop the entire planet. Imagine a storm so immense it wraps around the world. Mars is also known for its extreme cold, where carbon dioxide can freeze into snow or frost, similar to how water turns into snow and ice on Earth. The planet even experiences Mars quakes akin to earthquakes, indicating it's still geologically active. These fascinating aspects make Mars a prime focus for scientists and one of the most explored planets in our solar system, according to NASA Science. The iconic red color of Mars comes from iron-rich minerals in its soil and rocks. The surface is covered in a loose layer of dust called regolith. Unlike Earth soil, which teems with organic material like plants and microorganisms, Mars's regolith is primarily iron minerals and undergoing oxidation, or rusting, giving the planet its distinctive red hue. This rusting process is similar to how iron objects on Earth, like old nails or metal fences, turn reddish-brown when they rust, as noted by NASA. We know Mars as the Red Planet, a title earned from its endless expanse of rusted iron dust. But Mars hasn't always looked this way. For over 50 years, robotic explorers have unveiled a much different past. Evidence suggests Mars was once a dynamic, potentially lively world, with signs of water flowing abundantly. Ancient floodplains hint at massive deluges. Vast seabeds suggest former oceans. And alluvial fans indicate rivers once carried sediments across the landscape. Imagine a picture of Mars side by side with one of Earth's deserts. They might be indistinguishable. The dry riverbeds and dust-covered plains of Mars closely resemble Earth's arid deserts, showcasing their similarities. Though Mars likely had less liquid water than Earth, it clearly hosted significant bodies of water. Mars once boasted vast oceans, long winding rivers, and a climate that could have featured rainy, overcast days. Picture a Martian weather forecast with regular rain showers and cloudy skies, much like Earth's wetter regions today. The transformation from a potentially wet and lively world to the cold, dusty, and dry planet we see now is a puzzle scientists are eager to solve. They continue to study Mars's clues to understand this dramatic change and uncover the planet's mysterious history. Imagine traveling back billions of years to the dawn of our solar system. Picture two planets, Earth and Mars, both orbiting our sun in the habitable zone. They looked remarkably similar, brimming with potential for life. But Mars had a fatal flaw that sealed its fate from the very beginning. Despite its brilliant red hue in our night sky, Mars is small, only about 11% the mass of the Earth. This size difference caused its core to cool down much faster than Earth's, ultimately preventing it from becoming a life-supporting planet. All planets start warm, thanks to the breakdown of radioactive elements from the original gas cloud that formed our solar system, and the heat trapped during their formation. This heat is gradually released as infrared radiation, a slow and inefficient process. 
For instance, if you were thrown into space from far from the sun, it would take hours for your body to freeze. Similarly, as planets release this radiation, they slowly lose their internal heat and cool down over time. Earth still retains a lot of its heat for two main reasons. First, it's larger than Mars, so it's collected more heat during its formation. Second, a planet's surface area increases four times for every doubling of its volume, making larger planets slower at losing heat. Consequently, Earth's core remains molten, generating a magnetic field that deflects the solar wind, a stream of charged particles from the sun, protecting our atmosphere from being stripped away. Mars, however, wasn't so lucky. Within a billion years, its core cooled and solidified, weakening its magnetic field. Without this shield, the solar wind relentlessly stripped away Mars's atmosphere. The atmospheric pressure on the surface dropped, causing any liquid water to evaporate and escape into space as gas. This gas, once part of Mars's oceans, rivers, and lakes, was swept away by the solar wind, disappearing into the vastness of interstellar space. As Mars lost its atmosphere, it could no longer maintain the conditions necessary for sustaining liquid water on its surface. The once potentially lively and vibrant planet transformed into a cold, barren desert devoid of any hope for life. Imagine the once flowing rivers, vast oceans, and lakes evaporating into the void, never to return. The remnants of this water, now mingling with lost gases and particles from other cosmic events, float aimlessly in the cold, empty expanse between stars. This drastic transformation of Mars serves as a powerful reminder of the delicate balance required for life. Our Earth remains warm and hospitable, largely due to its size, which allows it to retain heat and maintain a molten core. This core generates a magnetic field, essential for deflecting harmful solar winds and preserving our atmosphere. Without it, our planet might have shared Mars's fate. Exploring Mars not only unravels its mysteries, but also provides valuable lessons about the conditions necessary for life. It teaches us about the forces that shape planetary environments, and emphasizes the importance of protecting our own world. Each discovery on Mars adds a piece to the puzzle of our own planet's history and future. Mars's journey from a potentially vibrant world to a desolate wasteland underscores the fragility of planetary environments. It highlights the razor-thin margin that separates a thriving, life-sustaining planet from a barren one. As we continue to explore the red planet, we gain insights that could help us understand the origins of life on Earth and how to safeguard it. In the grand cosmic ballet, Mars's fate is a poignant chapter. As we look up at the night sky and see Mars shining brightly, we're reminded of the fragile balance that makes our own world so special. And now we'd like to hear from you. What surprised you most to learn about the red planet? Be sure to let us know in the comments below, and if you enjoyed the video, give it a like and subscribe for more.